Hey guys, remember me? It's Rick, the engineer. I'm back. After a little hiatus there, uh, just doing all kinds of other stuff here in the summer months. We're back on the layout over here. Man, look at this. This guy has been sitting here for, man, almost a month right now. And uh, just haven't done anything on the layout because I've been doing all sorts of other stuff. But hey, we got the guy fired up here. Uh, I don't even know what kind of train this is. Oh my goodness. That's how long it's been. SD40. Just kidding there. Anyway, let's uh, let's try to roll this guy out and uh, get him into the yard at least. Uh, and then we'll see how the uh, track is. Since it's been sitting here for like practically a month. Getting dusty and everything. I gotta try to remember what my buttons are. I think the plan here is just to run this guy into the yard and uh, see how dirty the track is. See how much cleanup work we got to do here before we get uh, started back up and start uh, working on the layout over here. Now I know it's been a couple uh, weeks, uh, more than a couple weeks, like three, four weeks almost, something like that since I did a video. Uh, I did post one there saying I wasn't dead. I was just doing other stuff. And uh, as you could uh, tell by my videos there, I was doing a little bit of flight sim, got a new computer all set up, and uh, just playing around with that. Doing a couple other hobbies and things like that, plus taking a break here in the summer months. That's uh, it's always a good thing to do. Let's see here, I think we've cleared our turnout here. Let me go ahead and flip that. Or do I need to flip that? Yeah, I guess that's good. We'll flip it right there. I'm going to leave... Uh... We're going to do a runaround here is what I'm trying to figure out. We're going to get the uh, locomotive over on the other side of the uh, caboose. And then uh, we'll run back to, uh, to the yard if I can find my, uh, my little chopstick right here. And get this connected. So far, so good, considering I have not touched the layout in like a month. And as you can tell, it's uh, a little bit, uh, a little bit, uh, well, kind of in a shambles right here, right now. Uh, haven't done anything else. Uh, you can see I've been, I've been doing painting. And hey, we got the TV going over there. Lots of painting stuff here. All kinds of crap just lying around the layout. Time to get the cleaned up, get ready for the fall. It's nice and cool out here in uh, Southern California. It's like 75 degrees or so. So I figure it's time to get, uh, get back over here and get back on the layout. I've been playing uh, playing enough uh, with the flight simulator and I'm still doing that. Actually I've been playing uh, Starfield, if anybody's into gaming uh, you will recognize that name. A new uh, Bethesda game that came out. So I've been kind of screwing around with that. Building outposts. It's kind of uh, well it's kind of a little bit like having a layout. Except it's uh, in space. So I've been running around to all kinds of different planets, collecting materials, building outposts, meeting all sorts of uh, colorful characters in the game. Like uh, Mr. Torres here. Man, he's been, uh, he's been pretty good here, sitting on the front of that uh, SD40 for like the last month. And it looks like our turnout back there is uh, set. So we'll just run around it and uh, grab our uh, caboose and our little maintenance away car here. You can see we've got a bunch of junk in there. Just nails and a few ties, things like that. Rail joiners. It would be nice to get a little bit of scenery done here on this uh, new expansion. Ooh, right there is good. I know we're in the street there a little bit, but uh, hey. 
I'm just trying to figure out if I uh, still have the muscle memory there to actually run my controller. I forgot what all the buttons were for. That's how long I've been gone. Anyway, yeah, it's good to be running a train again. This is literally the first time I ran the train uh, since, uh, well, the last time you saw me running the train. And like you saw over there, I've been doing a little bit of house painting and uh, screwing around with uh, my computer games. Get connected up over here. Right there is good. So we'll shove back here and then uh, head down. Head down through orange here and uh, back around, make our way back over to, uh, to the yard. We'll see what's in the yard in a minute there. It looks like, uh, boy, it's a ton of cars there. I think I got everything that I own out in the yard right now. There's still a few cars and stuff like that in uh, in the industries that we'll see as we get, uh, get by them. But like I said, I haven't been doing anything out here, so uh, I don't know where, what cars are where, or what came into the yard last, or what what was set to go out. So we're kind of doing a little bit of a reset here. Let's see, I think our turnout back there looks good. Well, this will look really nice once I get some uh, background on there. You can see we got to do a stop over here behind uh, whatever industry this is. I don't even remember. <laughs> Westpac, I think. We got to stop over here because uh, we got a little bit of a debris in the uh, the roadway. Actually, I put that down there because if I leave it up here, not glued, it uh, it tends to curl up anyway. And looks like our turnout is uh, looking good back there. Go ahead and try to put this camera down. See, it's pretty bright looking on the camera here on the on the screen, but that's because there's no background, so it uh, the background sky color kind of washes uh, washes everything out. <clears throat> Plus, it's pretty bright over here on this uh, new section of the layout. And yeah, I'm looking forward to uh, doing my little Santa Ana River Bridge right here. And I think my turnouts are good back there. But while we run back there, let's take a look at the yard over here. Ooh, it's all packed up. Lots of cars. Oh my goodness, poor little Benjamin here. He's been sitting here waiting for months. Well, not months, weeks. All right, let's pop in here. We'll see how the track work is here. Like I said, I haven't touched the track for, uh, well, almost a month. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. And it's dusty in here. Time to, uh, time to get a little brush and start uh, cleaning off all the dust off the roads and the rails and things like that. At least, uh, at least all the horses are good. Except for that guy, he fell down. Let's take a look here. Yeah, I think we're good. 
Double checking my turnouts. I don't know where I left them. I love that horn. All right, we'll notch it up over here and get ourselves into the yard. Let's take a quick look ahead here. Just take a look at the uh, turnouts. Uh, those two look good. And that one looks good back there. And this one looks uh, looks like it's going into the yard. Let's go ahead and back it up. We'll get our uh, bridge down here. And let's see, since, uh, wow, we have got uh, the whole yard full. I think we're gonna be coming in on uh, on our locomotive track right there. We put the camera down here so it's not too shaky. And yeah, I know, it looks like snow-covered mountains here, but Ed, it's just styrofoam. Finally, man, I'm really surprised from all the uh, dust and uh, no real use on the uh, the layout for like a month. Uh, we haven't had one uh, one issue on the track. Hey guys, we're back. You know, it's been like almost four weeks. Mr. Mr. Torres has been over there. He's taking a nap up on front. All right, we'll shut it down over here. Well, guys, there you go. A little bit of operations, I know, kind of hokey, just getting uh, getting back into the swing of things here. But I do have some good plans to start working on uh, on everything here. Let me go ahead and zoom out, and uh, we'll take a little bit of a bigger look right here at the new the new section. I do have some black curtain that will go down and cover up the uh, washer and dryer back there. Sort of like I have over here, um, but I'm actually using it someplace else in the house, so I got to tear it down and uh, put it up over there. And then uh, we're going to start doing um, some basic scenery here. You can see we've got the ground cover already down from uh, like a month ago, uh, but we're going to start putting down some static grass and getting plaster out and plastering our streets, getting them all colored up. And I think the biggest change you'll see. Uh, will be with the actual background. So I'm going to start printing out background mountains again and get all of that uh, get all that blue sky covered up over here. Alright guys, I hope you enjoy that. I, I know it's a short video here and not much to it, but uh, hey, just trying to get back into the swing of things. Let's see what, uh, see what the real Benjamin is doing out here. Ooh, it's a nice, uh, oh, nice overcast day. Hey, Ben. Now you're getting all washed out. Ben, we're going to start running trains again. You good with that? All right. I think he's good, guys. All right. Until next time, guys. Ooh, good to be back and good to be doing another video again. Expect more videos coming up. We'll probably start out kind of slow, maybe one, one, one a week or something like that. We'll see how it goes. Um, because, uh, and you kind of ease back into it over here. I got to get the garage cleaned up a little bit over there with all my uh, little painting stuff. And then we can start working on this new section over here. 
All right, guys. Anyway, good to be back. And uh, thanks for sticking through the little hiatus there. And uh, don't worry. We'll get more videos out here. Start doing some ops and layout updates. Anyway, guys, Engineer Rick signing out for right now. Have a good one.